Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today is going to be an overview of how I store my Hot Wheels collection. So this is not really going to be like a Hot Wheels collection overview, but just more like the means at what I store all of my cars. So we're going to start it off. We are here in the Hot Wheels vault. And the first thing we're going to go over is this here, which uh, as you can see is my RLC collection. So this is just like a little piece of, I don't know, some kind of like hobby board in the back. And then I just have those like command, um, like quick hooks or whatever. And so all the RLC cars, um, I kind of measured it out to try to get the perfect fit and measurement. And so that is that. I think this is a pretty cool way of displaying these because um, my other ways of displaying that you'll see here in a minute, um, wouldn't necessarily work with like the protecto packs and stuff. And for the second form of storage for uh, some of my carded vehicles is these straight line or straight edge grout lines that I got from Home Depot. Um, you can set them up for whatever width you want. You can see I have premiums and main lines. Um, if we go over here, which is where I have like some of the super treasure hunts, um, you can kind of get a better idea. So I just uh, double-sided tape and stuck it onto the walls. And then the Hot Wheels, they literally just slide right in. So I can give you kind of a better overview of everything in here. You can see I have quite a few, quite a few cars put up in this manner. And here, this is uh, the side wall of the collection. And as you can see, you can even use it um, for the bigger team transports, which is pretty cool. Even uh, have it going around your light switches or whatever else you have going on in your room. Um, I even have it over here for some of these other brands, for some of these older uh, Fast and Furious cars, which is Racing Champions and the Revel, or Revel. Then we even have the uh, Jada little minis, which is pretty cool. So yeah, as you can see, that is a pretty good majority of my cars, um, including even uh, Super Treasure Hunts, which these are in Protecto Packs. But like I said, you can custom make this to however you want, um, just whatever width um, of car or card that you want to put in. So that is basically how I store everything on the card. So now let's move on to Loose. Okay, so to start off the loose collection here, which I have this whole right wall, are these Plano brand organizer cases. Um, so basically it's like a little case and you can pop the lid off and then it has um, holes already. You can see right there and then over there. And so you can easily mount it to the wall and you can see that part right there is kind of where the lid uh, gripped on. But yeah, it fits Hot Wheels cars perfectly. And I think they're only like like $9 a piece. So you can see I have it all kind of color, color coordinated here. But yeah, this is definitely an awesome cheap way. And um, I really wish I would have kept the lids. Because I actually thought about taking a couple of these off the wall. And using them to store cars um, for more long-term storage. But I tossed all the lids. So, but I will definitely be linking all this down below so that uh, if anyone wants to use any of these methods of storage, you can have it easily accessible. So next up here, we have these nicer display cases from Amazon, which uh, during kind of my research, it looks like these aren't really available anymore. Um, but I think these were around 60 to $70. And you can see it has a nice like glass backing the carbon fiber edge and I think these hold around like 64 cars but I have one here that has all of my BMWs and then over here on the other side this case has all of my Fast and Furious so the only downside is with this like the mirrored background it's kind of hard to film and photograph but other than that these cases look really nice I'll still put the link down below even though that seller 
currently doesn't have it available, but you might be able to find it somewhere else. Okay, and here for my last uh, storage solution for you guys here are these handy little um, carry cases. Um, these are probably the most common amongst collectors. I think basically everyone who collects Hot Wheels probably has these cases, but they hold 24 cars on each side, and it's nice it has a little carry handle, and you can even stack the cars kind of upside down on top of each other to double it up, but I usually just keep mine single because I'm pretty picky on how I like to keep my cars nice and fresh. But yeah, I'll, um, this one I actually got from Amazon, which was a little expensive. So I think there might be some other cheaper ways to go about getting these types of cases. Um, but I will link the one that I have still down below. But yeah, I think that's kind of going to wrap up this video. So hopefully some of the things um, that I showed you guys here today will help you in your Hot Wheels adventure in collecting and storing and I guess you could say hoarding, which probably a lot of us do. But yeah, just want to do a quick video and just kind of showcase all the ways I keep my cars. All right, until next time, catch you later. Peace.